Tuesday night baseball is on the air from Kauffman Stadium in Kansas City Missouri game one here in the month of May and look there at the starting pitcher charged with facing these guys as his numbers are on your screen. Now at the plate Willie Wagner he'll get us started in this one under the lights. Harold Number Reynolds eight. we look at the Royals as they enter play here tonight yeah. four and two over their last six games including a win last time out. Well Matt I really like the pitching staff but I think the key to this game is clearly falls on their shoulders. They throw off speed pitches for strikes and they mix the pitch as well. I think if they do that they got a chance to win weekly hit towards first. He's got to hurry yeah. and he'll take this to the bag himself and there's your first out of the ball game. Cole Calhoun will stand in now. It was a two for five effort from him in the series finale on Sunday. And this one's nowhere close as that bounces to the plate for ball one. That missed close. It's ball two. Outside three and oh now. I understand pitching carefully to this guy in the box but the man on deck doesn't represent any relief either. He's going to have to go after one of these guys. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Solaire is there and he makes the catch for the second out. Here's the center fielder Mike Trout. One of the better hitters in the league this year currently seventh in the American League in hitting. But an easy play over at first to glove it and the side is retired. So a relatively routine start for the top. Into the windup and the pitch. Off with the angels, Here's a swing and a high pop-up. Drifting pitch. toward oh. the third base dugout. Ball, ball, ball. Volpe will back up and put this one away just past the dugout for the first out. Here's Trevor Plouffe standing in. Looking to stay hot. Good. He's been a real base, threat at the plate seven. the last week or so. Trevor. Oh, and that one point. slung through the strike zone that time at 98. 0 and 1. Squared that one up just a little late. No go, score guys. here Let's as we go. play inning number two. Now a swing and a miss. He struck him out, and it's two up, two down to start the second. Here's Luis Valbuena now. The average for him entering play, not far hitter. north of 200. And he'll start the at bat with a slider that didn't miss by a whole lot. It's ball one. And he fires in a strike this time to make it one ball and one strike. Lays off the slider that time. Two and one. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. Oh, he's going to want that pitch again. That ball's right down the middle in his wheelhouse. His eyes lit up. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. We'll go down one. In now is Andrelton Simmons. Back on Sunday, he picked up a hit in five trips to the plate. And a called strike down in the zone. Nothing in one. The wind up and the 0 1. And he gets a piece here as this ball is fouled away. And they'll try to tempt oh, him yeah, with a curveball, but this bounces in front of the plate and it's 1 and 2. Tried to get him to chase that 0 2, 2 curveball there, but he wasn't biting. Very well could see it again here, though. Fouled back. Here's a high foul ball as it finds a lucky fan in the upper deck for a souvenir. And again, he's unable to keep it fair, but he's putting together quite a battle at the plate. Well, that's three foul balls in a row. He's definitely battling up there. And he'll finally just wear him down as this one swung on and missed for the first out. Stepping up now, Danny Espinosa. And he's been a tough out these past couple of weeks as the numbers there tell you the whole story. Watches a fastball right there for strike one. Just lucky to make contact on that one as it's chopped foul. The 0-2 delivery. And he struck him out as well. So the bottom of the order providing little resistance here. And there are two away. Big curveball for the strikeout there. And that came after an absolute missile of a fastball. Even if you recognize the breaking ball out of the pitcher's hand, it's so hard for hitters to sit back long enough after they've seen a really good fastball. Only the best can keep their hands back on those. This is swung on and lifted down the left field line, but it'll get back into the crowd as he jumps ahead of him now, 0-2. And that slider's almost in the dirt. 
Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Two down now. Well, I think he's trying to get that two-strike fastball out of the zone. Just got too much. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Digging in to try it again. Willie Wagner. 0 for 1 oh, yeah. for him here in this one. Willie well, if you love pitching Wagner. and defense, this has been a game for you. Are you happy with that, Dan? Oh, you have to love You know, Matt, we have so many of these games that are 12 to 10 and 9 to 8. It's nice to see a low-scoring pitcher's duel for once. Well, he's watched himself struggle now. His average has fallen below 240. So that's a welcome hit for him and I'm sure the manager as well. That Cole Calhoun stands in as he looks at ball one here. Calhoun. The one and no delivery. And this is just off the outside corner, ball two. On, Matt, two this right is here. where that guy on first base is distracting the pitcher. I guarantee you, he's down 2-0. and oh. He's not focused on the hitter. This is where you get hurt. I love it when a guy on first can run. Ready for another chance? Mike Trout comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. And here's a slider that's nowhere close, and it's 1-0. and Fastball got him to swing through it. It's 1-1. One and one. The 1-1 one, one pitch. And he pulled up in time, but it's a called strike two. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. Hey, just you and him. Get him yourself. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time. Out number two. Boy, that's really disappointing for a guy that has wheels, right? All he wants to do is get on base and take advantage of the strength of his game, which is his speed. But with the strikeout right there, you can't get on first base if you strike out. Get ahead, now stay ahead now. The first baseman, C.J. Crone. Two down here. Here's C.J. Crone now as he'll look at a fastball in there on the outer half. It's 0-1. He's 0-1 thus far. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Swing and there it goes. Deep to left. No chance at bringing this one back. And it clears the stands. Wow. That landed on the patio out there. Into the box now, Trevor Plouffe, as he will look at a first pitch fastball for ball one. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Well, that fastball is just sizzling up there, one and one. And this is sliced foul into the stands in right, out of play. Trying to send him packing for the second time. And he struck him out, his seventh of the ball game, and that Stepping in and ready for another Hitting shot. For the Luis Valbuena. Designated 0 for hitter. 1 for him here in Luis this one. Valbuena. First pitch of the inning is taken low and away for a ball. It's 1 and 0. Well, it should be 2 and 0, but he goes way out of the zone to go after that one, and it's even 1 and 1. Outside with the fastball as the count moves no to 2 now. and 1 no now. A wave and a miss, a tick behind a good fastball. Well, as demonstrated there, that's a tough pitch to do anything with. Yeah, good luck. But hey, a high fastball all of a sudden becomes really dangerous for a pitcher if it's not spotted above the zone. A little height difference makes all the difference. Again, he sends it out of play. Looking to fade his first walk. Here it comes. Hard hit and deep toward the right field line. And this is going to be extra bases here to kick off the fifth. Cut it, cut it, cut hold. And he will pull into second with a leadoff double. So a ringing double here to kick off inning number five. And we check out the Angels please. leaders in that category. Well, just an excellent job right here closing this one out. He just collected the first save of his career. Got to start somewhere. Time of the ball game, three hours and 30. A coach acknowledges a pitcher on his recent spree of strikeouts. He's on a torrid pace. They'll see if he can keep it up.